tube. I'm uh, painting the back of the aquarium because it's clear on all four sides and um, I've heard a lot of people discussing what paint to use etc etc and it's really kind of one of those choices that you have to make but um, I'm using something that actually said that you could paint on glass with it so it's a bit of an experiment but it's this uh, chalkboard rust-oleum rust chalkboard paint and so far it's not coming out too bad this is um, the first coat still painting I figure uh, I probably put about three four maybe five coats I've taped off the edges I've taped off the uh, stand base and I'm using a uh, short nap roller to actually apply this so I'll probably do like I said you know four or five coats see how it goes right now though this stuff is it's sticking to the paint exactly the way I wanted it to so I think this is a uh, a pretty doggone good idea. I think it's going to work out pretty good. This is the first coat. I'm just finishing it up. And, um, hey, hopefully it'll be the perfect paint for the back of an aquarium. I don't plan on, uh, you know, peeling it off, anything like that, changing color. So I wanted to go with the black, which is what I'm used to. So this is the first coat, like I said. Of course, you can see all through it with the first coat being applied. But um, I'll come back with more video and uh, so you can see the progress. All right, YouTube, this is the front of the tank after one coat. As you can see you can still kind of see through it in spots but uh, we'll put on about two three coats and see how it turns out it's the 125 long painting the back of the aquarium using this uh, chalk board paint so far so good kind of liking it it's not deep, deep, deep black, but it's more like an asphalt type color. I kind of like it. But we'll be back after coat number two, coat number three, etc. All right, YouTube, coat number two going on, and uh, dang, it's not bad. Not bad at all. Looks like I got pretty good coverage. That's just coat number two. 30 minutes between coats. From the front. Uh, not bad at all. Reflection. Uh, see. Yep. So far. So good. All right, third and final coat. Looking good. Looking real good. Solid black. No light coming through. It's more of a, I don't know, uh, asphalt color, I guess. Sorry for the reflection, but that's three coats, 30 minutes between coats, and this stuff went on like butter. Highly suggested. I'll wait for it to dry, and then, uh, you know, give you an overview once it's dry. All right, folks, so here it is, the finished product. Entire back. 
painted black with that uh, chalkboard paint inside beautiful 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 came out the way I wanted it to see if I can put some light in here perfect highly recommend this paint uh, for painting the back of your aquarium that's for sure worked out pretty well only took uh, three coats so Testarossa 101 with uh, painting the back of the 125 Flows look good too. Came out pretty nice. Testarossa 101 signing out. Time to take the tape off and call it a day.